Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Into The Future. I'm Landros, and, um, turn this off. Uh, okay, Luke, you're actually still hunting, aren't you? Um, yeah, I didn't get money, I didn't get many points this time, because it came up with that one from Generations, and it was so fast, I didn't have anything to do. Alright, Luke, what I want you to do is I want you to stop what you're doing, because you are exhausted. It's already, oh wow, I've got you guys completely off of your days and nights, don't I? Alright, let's go ahead and change you into your human form. And then I'll get you started on something else. Let's see. Travel to the present. We are going to do that eventually. Not this episode. Um, all right. Hang on. i got to keep going, figuring out what I'm doing. Okay. I want you to go ahead and get your jetpack. Where's your jetpack? Here it is. Let's start using that thing. And um, <clears throat> now we're going to go ahead and jetpack home. Yeah, I can do it one of two ways. You can do it this way, or you can just go click on the ground somewhere. You can do it either way you like. So it's just kind of up to you. Um <clears throat> Typically, I like to go click on the ground and then tell him where I want him to go, but for right now, this is fine. Okay, I want you to go ahead and come on up here and join her dream, which hopefully is actually a good one. It's not. You got to keep influencing it, and uh, Jetpack to the Moon is a good thing. Um, you do it enough, you influence it enough, then she'll actually start having a good dream, and it'll go green, and then they'll actually get an advantage to um, all the stuff. We got a lot of stuff to do, and... Um, <clears throat> We got a full moon tonight. Oh, we're actually just finished with the full moon. That's right. Okay, buddy. You ready? Get you in here. Get you to go to bed. Um, there are hot spots here, but I don't really want to go do that just yet. Collect 15 gems. We could do that. That's actually very easy. That's one of the nice things about the werewolf. If you're trying to get points, man, you can rack up a lot. All right. Uh, Crash. Crash is actually a girl. I didn't know. I kept thinking Crash was a guy. Crash needs maintenance, and um, you can actually main, uh, maintain yourself. So go ahead and maintain yourself. I don't think that's going to help her change her quality. Um, her quality is weak, and we're going to fix that. I don't really want to go too far. I don't want to spend a whole lot of money and a lot of time because, of course, this Plumbot is not really going to be the one I'm going to work on for um, long term. Uh, can, I, can I make you clean? No. I could make you clean, but you're just going to kind of hang out, do what you want to do. Keep, uh, keep yourself preoccupied. And I don't know if you need to give yourself another tune-up, but you can. And we'll just see if that actually helps you. I don't think it'll does. I don't think it'll do anything with this. That's only from uh, Luke. Luke's the one that's going to have to do it, or Meredith if she learns the skill. All right, you guys been in here long enough. How about if I influence you and do this whole Sonic Bubbles? There you go. But it's still not green. <laughs> it it doesn't happen all the time, but it uh, eventually they'll start having dreams that are good. They start off that way, and you don't have to keep influencing it and keep doing it. But right now, this is okay. We'll just continue trying it. It's another way that you don't have to actually go through speed 3 or speed 4 to play when they're sleeping. You actually have something to do, which is kind of nice. Now, you can't do it with all the beds. You just do it with a stream bed. And the dream bed's actually a pretty decent one. It, um, it gives you a pretty decent level of energy. I'm not going to let them sleep in the whole day and waste our whole entire day. So, yeah, they're going to be kind of tired, and they're going to come home tonight, and they're going to crash, which is fine. That's really what I want. I don't really want them to do a whole lot else. Okay, Meredith, you're actually not too bad off, are you? Um, but I'm going to let you go ahead and use this thing real quick. And did you want to clean that? Oh, you know what? I'm going to make you unbreak make that unbreakable before you do anything else. Then you can use it. And you can't really upgrade that one yet. Um, I don't know if your skill... Nope, skill level 9. Okay. Um, why don't we go with... This room is supposed to be blue. Let's go with blue. Okay, let me go ahead and get you up now. You're fine. And Luke, I'm going to let you get a little bit more, and then I'm going to have you get up and do basically the same thing. Um, Meredith, I'll come back and see you in a minute, but I want to get you set up to eat too. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because I don't want this thing to break on us all the time. Um, have some waffles, and you can go ahead and do the same thing. Have breakfast calzone. All right, so anyway, this is why you have a level 10 witch. <laughs> Trust me, it, it is fantastic. She can upgrade stuff, and it's so much quicker than the handiness skill. Um, and you don't have to worry about things getting broken all the time. Then you just hit one spell on the on the floor, and you can clean the whole house. You don't ever have to hire a repairman, and you never have to hire a maid if you don't want to. Now, of course, we're going to get a plumb bot, and we're going to make them do all this for us. But for right now, this is perfect. This is exactly what I need. Okay. 
we were working on her nanite collection, and let me just kind of look while she's doing all this. We've got, let me count them up, one, two, three, she doesn't have all of them. She really doesn't. Um, prismatic, uber, and optic, and entropic. Oh, man, why didn't I sell this thing? Because I forgot. <laughs> all right, so she needs, which two of those does she need? She needs dispersion and damping. Okay. Because I want to make sure she's got them all before I actually get rid of them. Um, you want to advance the skill? Yes, you do. Get rid of this one. I need to get rid of that one, too. I'm not going to use it. Um, cast a restoration ritual? You can do that easily. Uh, before you actually go, why don't you just do it? Clean everybody. Okay, while you're actually doing that, <clears throat> let me go check and see if we have a damping or a dispersion that shows up. <clears throat> I'm getting to where I kind of know what they look like. Not exactly. I still have trouble trying to figure them out. <clears throat> this one right here gives you some of your really good ones. So always go to this one just because um, I like it. I like this little spot. It's a really good place for things to spawn that are um, high value. Go ahead and catch this one. And let's see what else you needed. Uh, damping. Where's damping? It's not you. I keep looking at you, but I know it's not you. They're stamping. See, they look very, very similar. This way we'll know that she's gotten all the um, the rare ones. And then after that, there we go. Once she's gotten all the rare ones, then we'll work on the other ones. Okay, let's see what else she needs. As far as these little ones, she has Caustic, Leptin, Scalar. That's all you got. Caustic, Leptin, and Scalar. Okay, so I need to find, there's five more of those. Okay. Quantum, you need that one. So she's going to be doing this today, and he's going to be doing this today. We're going to be working on getting all the nanites. I want to have at least one in their inventory of everything. I'd love to have two, to be perfectly honest with you. If I could, it'd be great. So Quantum is captured. Um, triple, you need. All right, we'll go ahead and do... Oh, you can't do it until you actually finish up. Okay, buddy, you're good. Yeah. Oh, man, you almost got a full energy bar, too. I didn't mean to make you sleep that long. That's okay. Um... Do what you got to do. I'm going to send him out here. He's going to go ahead and fly over here and collect these. Catch these two guys. I'm sure he needs them. And then she's going to go ahead and catch this one. Okay. That was Tribble. Um, I think I just got Leptin, didn't I? Heisenberg, I know you need. <clears throat> okay. Um, there's two of them, so I'm going to have you fly over here and catch one, too. There's supposed to be two of them. All right, so here's one. And are you ready yet? No, it takes you forever to get out of the building. <laughs> it's too funny. Okay. <clears throat> Eventually they'll catch up to me because um, once they get out of the building, it's pretty fast. All right, go ahead and fly over here. And catch this one. Okay. Um, so that'll take care of that one. Let's see, what else we got? Quantum, you got. Neutron, you don't have. I don't think you have it. You might, but... Come on. Where are you at? Here we go. Oops. You catch him and catch him. Can't do it yet. I'm glad it doesn't take too long for them to catch all these things. Okay. Going back into their journal. I will be in this journal quite a bit, guys. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. Um, you don't have torque at all. Okay. So let me see how many of these you got. You have one, two, three. Uh, I don't know if you got four, five, six. Seven. All right, well, I don't know which one you need, but if I see Torque, I'm going after it right away, and it's the one that looks like a little cube. There's Torque right there. See how easy you just ask for it, and it's there. <laughs> it just shows up. Um, not unless you have this little opportunity. <laughs> That's really the only reason. Okay, go ahead and catch him, and let's see, Luke, I'm going to let you go catch these. I'm sure you need them, too. You guys got to catch everything today. Um, because then I want to get started on bot building, and I want to build our own bot. I don't really want to worry about. Um, I know we're going to take Crash, and we're going to sell Crash, um, but we got to upgrade and do some work on her first before we do that. I'm not really spending a whole lot of time on her. I know, I know it's awful, but all right, Luke, you can come over here and get these. Hopefully they'll show up. Come on, guys. See if you're just scouring the desert waiting for them to pop up, they don't do it. They won't show up that quickly. Um, you have to kind of 
Wait till it happens. Oh, he's already coming to get these. All right, I got you. All right, so don't have to fly back over here if you don't want to. Oh, Okay. You need to head back over to this side. What is this one? I don't know if you need it, but he probably does. Caustic, Neutron. Okay, <laughs> let's go take a look now that you got most of these in here. You have Neutron, Heisenberg, Tribble, and Quantum. Scalar, Lepton, and Caustic. Okay, then which one do I not have? Light. Um, is that the only one I don't have? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, I'm missing light. All right, so let's go see if we can find one. Light, light, light. And nope, it's not that one. It'll be one of these little, like a spider looking ones. Okay, there's light. See, I told you. You ask, <laughs> there it is. All right, come on over here real quick. Let's get your last one of this category. Like I said, I just want you to get one of every category, and that way I know you've caught them, and he's he's going to need to do the same thing. Okay, so now we can work on your other ones. And uh, as far as what the other ones you got, you have tunneling, thermo, you have condenser, polar. Okay, which two are you needing? Because there's only six of those. See, I got these down now. Um, need torque, which we're getting right now, and you need induction. Okay. All right, so if we find an induction, then we've got them all. I think, except for these. I've got one more i got to get out of the cubes. All right, so let's go up and find induction. Luke, I know you're over there doing whatever. Um, I'll be with you in a minute, I promise. Okay, I'm pausing just because I have to <laughs> ask for induction, and <laughs> here's induction. I right, go ahead and fly here, and Luke, I'm going to have you do this in just a minute, but I want her to get this one. And then she can go do some excavating or something after a while. Um, I'll keep her busy for a little bit. All right, go ahead and crap, uh, catch that one. Luke, you're done. Go ahead and fly over here. Catch these guys. And catch that over there. That's the main one I really want you to get. Okay. So the last one that she needs, she's got um, Entropic, Ooh. Optic, mm -hmm. Uber, oh, <laughs> Prismatic. So you got four. Dispersion and Dampy. Oh, you got them all. All right, so you're good. Okay, let me go ahead and have you go to, is it this place or this place? I think it's this place. I'm wrong. It's not this one. It is this one, or is it this one? I can't remember. Uh, we'll go here first. It's this one. All right, this one's got four um, debris piles. So I'm gonna have her come over here and just work on these for a little bit and have her excavate. And then she can also work on, um, maybe these things are ready to harvest. Nope. Are you ready? Yes, you are. All right, that'll keep her busy for a little bit. And then let me look at Luke real quick and see before we actually get started. Um, he's got, uh, let's start with the hard ones. He's got Heisenberg. Is that the first man? got a lot of junk in here. He's got a light, Heisenberg, he has scalar. I need to write these down so I don't have to keep looking at it. And caustic. Okay, so going up in the map view, let's see what else comes up. Anything that does not have those names, he's got that. Um, he's got that. Oh gosh, caustic. He needs these two. All right, so you're going to come over here and get these two real quick. Um, it'll keep you somewhat busy. <clears throat> I just want to get them. Um, once they actually have all caught one of each, then I'm happy. Does it really matter? Um, no. As long as the family has them, it's fine. Um, it doesn't really make a big deal. Okay, so that was Lepton and Quantum. You need Tribble. All right, so we're going to go over here and find Tribble. And you might as well just collect anything else that's here while you're there. Okay, take your time. <laughs> It'll show up. Uh, you're here too. Okay, catch that one. And I know there's another one that I'm missing. I just can't remember what it was. Okay, I'm sure you need all these caustic torque. I don't think I said neutron, did I? I don't think I did. All right, well, he's coming over for neutron. And you know, you might as well collect this rock. 
whatever it is and catch you <clears throat> catch you okay now, <laughs> I wish I could have seen it but unfortunately I couldn't all right can I move you down into the bottom no I wish I could all right so I've got light triple I had plenty of triples I got one two three four five six um, seven and eight alright so we got all of those that's fine so I've got all the easy ones to find as far as the other ones I've got one thermo um, where are the others one two and what was that two thermo and induction I have and torque I got those three and I got condenser thermo torque condenser and torque okay and induction okay I got that one what are the other two I need um, I don't remember don't remember okay well he should be catching these two I think these are the last two so you need um, wait a minute no he needs you didn't catch a scalar Oh, I gotta go catch it. Okay, so anyway, we need thermo. I need tunneling. Okay. Tunneling and polar, I definitely need. I think everything else you got. Alright, and those are out. I saw them. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Alright. Tunneling, here we go. Okay, Luke, come on over and grab it from here. And I gotta remember to go find those other two that. Um, did not show up that you had collected. I just wanted you to have credit on your um, collection journal that you got them. So we'll get them. And let's see. Wrong person. <laughs> scares me when I don't see it. I'm like, where'd it go? Okay, tunneling, induction, induction, damping. I don't think you have. Uh, maybe you do. I'm really not sure. Not you. That's uh, okay. You can come over here when you want. I don't really care. It'll just work on your skill. Uh, go ahead and collect and catch it I don't know what I'm collecting I really don't <laughs> I have no clue um, there we go and then go over and grab these whatever they are because I don't think I told you to uh, come on catch that one catch that one all right let's take a look we're going after a scalar and we're going after an induction um, which one of those I think is induction and we're going after a polar and I think that was that would be it scalar should be out scalars are easy to find they're common um, I say that now now that one don't even bother with it it's underground you can't find it I've looked <laughs> I've looked a million, a million times um, that was induction I should have gone for it but I'm looking for their scalar basically you just have them all here you just have to keep looking again if you don't have that you can always go over to the um, the bot emporium and you can just purchase them whenever they show up there's no guarantee that they're gonna show up but you can get them okay um, he should have everything I would think you just count the uh, the cone looking ones he's got one two three four I didn't count the right ones, did I? No, I didn't. I wasn't counting them. All right, before you guys get going. Okay, that's the wrong one. I already counted those, so I know he's got all those. No cones here. He's got one cone. <clears throat> one, two, three. Is that all you got? No, you had more than that, didn't you? I guess not. So you have induction. You have thermo and you have tunneling all right induction thermo and tunneling that means I need torque condenser and polar okay Meredith help me out torque condensing and polar um, please tell me they're out I don't see them no 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 okay <laughs> they will show up eventually over time you'll get them um, 
Was that what I thought it was? Yeah, it's condenser. I did need it. All right, so I was thinking I needed a condenser. I went right by it. Um, okay, buddy. Not you. You got to fly over. And let's see what we can come up with. <clears throat> it takes forever. If you're done, you might as well go ahead and fly too. That way I'll get you guys both busy. Um, working on a skill. Okay, there should be another one. Did it say there were two over here? I swear I saw him. There it is. All right, go ahead and catch that. Okay. What's that one? Thermo. Hey. Thank you for being right there. You go ahead and fly here. And you fly over here. This one, always on the hill. Yeah, come on. It'll be right here. It should be. There it is. Almost landed right on top of it. Okay, so that's thermo. And now you just need polar. Eh, you guys are getting cold. <laughs> I hate that. Oh, here's polar. Ah, I love it. Okay. Fly on over. And bring you back. Okay, he should be getting most all of them. Um, I just want to catch the other ones before we lose them all. Go ahead and catch that. And what is that? Catch it. Whatever it is. Catch this. Okay. And let's see. That took care of all those. So looking at the cubes, what does he got? He has one, two, uh, three, four, five, and six. All right, he's got all of them. And so if I look at his collection journal, he should be cleared. Everything should have been captured by him. He got credit for them all. The reason he does it is because down here, if you look over here, he is now considered a nanite collector collect at least one of each type and now you'll get wild nanites to start to appear around your personal bot building station you want that so <laughs> that way you don't have to keep going out hunting for them but you're gonna find out we're we're never gonna have to hunt for them again it's pretty cool okay um, there's something I could have her do she's got everything doesn't she does she get credit for everything before I leave the the wastelands I want to make sure Cause if not I want to go back and make sure she does it I know she's got everything no she doesn't torque you need torque Okay, so do you have everything? Gosh, I gotta do this again. That's <laughs> so frustrating. One, two, three, um, four, five, six, seven, eight. You got those. One, two, three, four, five, and you missing torque. Uh, the big ones, you got one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so torque's all you miss. All you're missing. Come on, good old torque. Nope, nope, nope. Torque is the um the cone. Not you. Not you, not you. Um, <clears throat> Alright, maybe up here. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, maybe it will be, maybe it won't. Induction. Lots of induction tonight. Um, torque. There we go. Alright, you go ahead and fly here and I'll get you taken care of. That way both my guys are set up for all of their... Um, what you call it? It's their nanites, which is what I want. Okay, go ahead and grab this one. And you might as well grab him while you're at it, too. And if you see things that are actually just moving, just go ahead and get them. Oh, so you didn't get torque. That stinks. That really stinks. Okay, I hate that. Alright, so we gotta keep looking for another torque. Uh, they do do that every once in a while, so you just kinda have to expect it. Um, it's not very often, so. Now we just have to go find another one, which I don't see one yet. It'll show up. As long as we get it done before 11, we're good. Not like it won't show up again. Torque, here you are. Alright, go ahead and fly over here. And Luke, don't waste your time. Fly over here too. There we go. Do not lose this one. <laughs> this is all we need. If you can get that done, you'll be good. Now, how many pieces of... Um, oh, you got... Mm, three of them. I'm not going to let you do the opportunity, um, and there's a reason for that. So, the reason you don't want her. Okay, you got it. That's fantastic. All right, so she should now, if I look at it, she should have credit for everybody. And, yep, she's a nanite collector, so she's got everything cleared. She's good. 
and we have one of everything in the inventory which is what I was hoping for okay let's go ahead and take these guys back to our um, community lot go ahead and fly here and you're gonna go ahead and fly here too get you guys in um, something I wanted to do when you guys get over here is she too tired Yeah, she's kinda tired alright what I want you to do is I want you to go ahead and um, go ahead and do a shock bra real quick let's go ahead and um, there's not enough room to do anything here oh well we're just gonna come right over here because you guys did it over here last time you were flying around over here so you guys go ahead and walk over here <clears throat> At least you got your backpacks on and we are going to go ahead and have you guys um, do a jetpack woohoo we haven't done that yet if you let uh, you didn't have any warm-up to it at all you're probably gonna refuse him <laughs> probably will oh no she's not no she's not I did not do any foreplay whatsoever it's just jumping right into it okay it goes off screen so you don't actually see it all right, so you just get a little trail of hearts. That's all you got. Can you try for a baby on this thing? I don't know. Maybe we have to be um, boyfriend and girlfriend. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, <laughs> it's going to take you a while. Uh, you're leaving a trail of hearts. Um, go up there, and there's really nothing there. Well, how many times are you guys going to woohoo? <laughs> I don't know. Um, it doesn't seem to be ending. Okay, there we go. All right, well, that was, <laughs> All right, that was kind of cool. Um, let's see. He's not too tired. She is beat. Um, let's go upstairs. Let's see. Where's Crash? Crash, you're fine. Um, where is my bed? It's not on this floor. It's on this floor. Okay, I always got to remember it's on the one that has the um the stations. Is she hungry? Eh, she's kind of hungry. She could eat real quick. Let's go ahead and do that. That'll actually build up the skill a little bit. Order up some sushi. You go ahead. You're kind of hungry too. Uh, you can have autumn salad. Why not? And then get you guys going. Um, you might as well go ahead and just take advantage of your time. Use this thing. Quickie cleanse and then I'll let you dream. You're off. Are you broken? Please tell me I broke it. I hope I broke it. Yes, I broke it. Good deal. I don't have to actually see that going on there anymore. Okay. <clears throat> now, when you get done, I'm going to send you over to Crash. And Crash, look at you dancing. All right. We're going to go ahead and um, let's upgrade our chip slots. And we're going to give her a tune-up. Uh, where's tune-up? Yep. Give her a tune-up real quick. And... What else do I want? Um, adjust your trade chips. That's what we'll do. Okay. Meredith. <laughs> I was going to say, it's not that hard to walk over there and get this stuff. It already does it for you. You don't have to cook or anything. Uh, but what we'll do is we'll go ahead and we'll take um, we'll take Crash out. Do, we, uh, do I want to go into the ship? Yeah, we can go into the ship. You don't actually have to wait for an opportunity. You can go at any time. Um, you can get the opportunity from the time traveler, um, but you don't have to. Once you have this, the four pieces of the key, you can go do whatever you, you can go do it whenever you want, and you can do it as often as you want. You just have to keep assembling the key. So that's why you'll have to go um, dig through those debris piles. I hate that. Break. Come on, please break. No, I couldn't get so lucky. I could take him out. All right, you guys aren't too bad. Crash. Come on over. Let us get this done. I love the adjusting, um, uh, the upgrading. Come on. Can you not do it? What did I just miss out on? I didn't do the trait slots. All right. Okay, so we'll do this twice. I love the animation for um, upgrading the cha the trait chips. He just bangs them on the head. <laughs> it's so funny. It's silly, but I like it. <laughs> All right, so you go ahead and now remember he was actually at a weak status, still is, 
but we're gonna actually pull that up. Oh, battery power is low. Very low. Alright, we'll finish this up. Did you do it? Uh, you did. Alright. Tune up again. Who is it? This thing? I know this thing's driving me nuts. I'd like to get this done. No. Go away. <laughs> Just go away. Set a tune up. Yeah, I want the trade chips done. Alright. And unfortunately, Crash can't get in here to use this thing. I know that was the whole reason that she was trying to use that, but still. Can we siphon while they're in there? Um, not unless I'm on her. No, it's already being used. Ah, eh, great. Okay. Get these traits in here. We're going to actually see what we can come up with. Uh, you know we're going to dream about the same thing. I know it. It's ridiculous, but I'm doing it all the time. Okay, let's go ahead and set your dream. Let's influence you to jetpack to the moon. That's good. All right, get in there and do it. And then, okay. Um, I'm going to give you friendly functions. I think that'll be a good one. And we upgraded, so now you have all these trait slots open. So I can actually put a whole bunch in there. And um, I'm not going to because you don't have to right away. Anyway, let's go ahead and tune up again. And... One more time, maybe. And if we look right here, I know she's exhausted. It's still weak. We haven't actually done much yet, um, but we will improve it. And you just have to keep doing these um, tune-ups. This is one of the things that I don't like. This is why I won't actually start bot building until I'm pretty high up in the skill or like a level 10 like he is. Because you have to do this repeatedly just to get the um, the status to come up. His quality, the quality doesn't come up right away. Whoop, whoop. Receive tuna. Oh, is that what you could do? All right. Well, I wanted him to do the tune-up, so you go ahead and do it. No, you're not going anywhere. You're not sleeping yet. We're doing this thing. Come on. Stop it. Don't do a sub tune-up. <laughs> All right. Fine. We just want to get this thing done so we can get you a little bit higher quality. Normally it'll pop up and it'll tell you when you've got that high quality. And we can't do anything with you yet because you're exhausted. All right. Go to bed. <laughs> if you're tired, go to bed. <laughs> That's just the easy way to do it. And I need to get Luke to bed too. I was trying to get him on a better sleep pattern. Uh, the relationship has a lot to do with how they advance as well. So, for some reason, it seems like it does. Mm, come on. Tune up again? No. One more time, and then I'm going to let you go to bed. Okay, you're going to go ahead and join, um, join her dream. And let me just influence you a little bit. And um, make interdimensional friends. You'll like that. Okay. What's wrong with you? Oh, you're powered down. You're out. You are you are dead tired. Okay, but see, that's one way to actually get your power back up. You'll do it on your own. Um, force shutdown. <laughs> All right, I knew it. And that's for eight hours. So, Luke, you're not going to stick around for You're not going to sit around for eight hours. So that's one way to do it if you um, don't have an energy station. Uh, it's not the best because you're stuck there with nothing. And he can't even go over there to the other one. So... It's okay. As far as his status, I think he's still weak and eh, it's not good, but we'll do what we can do. Okay, get in here. She's already getting a good dream, so hopefully you'll join in and get the same dream and get the same quality, I hope. Um, maybe, maybe not. But I love it when I see the green. The green Zs make it really nice. Okay, I'm going to keep it on slower speed until I know for sure. Okay, let's influence you guys. Oh, not you. Um, oh, don't wake him up. All right, go ahead and influence us to read the manual first. There you go. And they're now in a, a nice happy dream, which is good. Okay, crash. Oh, okay, didn't take you eight hours. I'm sorry, go recharge. You'll get there. <laughs> so you're just in a bad mood for eight hours. I, I got you. I thought it was eight hours that you were going to be stuck not able to move. That would have been really awful. 
So that's okay. So if you're actually playing as a sim or plumbot and you're out in the wasteland and you run out of energy, I wondered what was going to happen. Were you just going to be stuck out there until somebody came and got you? But no, you'll actually recharge on your own. It's just not that much fun. <laughs> not that much fun at all. All right, so they're fine. Let me go ahead and speed them through um, their dream real quick because it'll take them forever. I am going to go over and make sure that they're still doing the green, which they are. We're getting better at this dream thing. We really are. So go ahead and do a quickie cleanse. And then Meredith, you're actually in pretty decent shape. You don't actually have to do it because you did it before you left. Okay. And the dreams go back and forth. Um, you'll see it go white and green all the time. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. All right. She's apprehensive about the future. Uh, so you didn't do so well. Ah, uh, well, I tried. At least they weren't bad dreams. Um, you're fine. I had something for you to go do, and I can't remember what it was. Oh, yeah, I do remember what it was. You were going to actually go over to the bot emporium. So I'm going to send you over there real quick. And, uh, Luke, when you get up, let's see, I'm going to let you go ahead and take care of your needs, and I'm going to get you to eat something first. Um, go ahead and have the country bread. You can come on over here to the bot emporium. Well, actually, I'm going to let you stay there for right now. I'll go with Meredith. <clears throat> now I taught Luke the bot building skill by reading the books. That was that was planned. I did that on purpose because he's going to do that job. I purposely made sure that Meredith did not learn it. I wanted her to be completely fresh and do it um, the other way. So I did that on purpose so I could show you two different versions of how to be a bot builder. Um, and like I said, I'm really tempted to just get rid of her job and change her into being a bot builder as well. Um, she could actually do that here, but I don't know if it'll actually let you keep that job. You know what? Let's do that. Let's go ahead and jobs and offers. No, can't do that. Where's jobs and professions? Okay, you don't have the skill yet, so you got to actually come over here and do this. Let's go ahead and design a nanite real quick. See, now you could actually start off right now. You could come um, uh, customize your plum, your plumb bot, but you can't actually create one. Not until you hit level two. And I'm not going to let them do that. And see, this is what she's going to get constantly because she doesn't have a high skill. You're going to notice Luke doesn't get the skill. Uh, not very much. All right, you're going to go here with Crash when Crash is ready. And we're going to actually work on Crash here. Okay, so when you see that, she's going to actually end up... She got a point. She did get that one. So at this point, if we wanted to, we could get her to register her job. And so she could become a bot builder uh, and get credit for what she's going to do. So I'm going to send her out. She's going to have to go to the city hall and um, get that thing registered, which is fine. Um, the only thing you do not want her to do, and guys, you got to be careful. She has this deliver the objects opportunity. That's the one that's showing up all the insects. Do not let her go to the science or to the hospital, the science lab or the hospital. Don't let her go because if she if she goes this automatically gets turned in and then you're gonna lose that opportunity so don't do it there is an opportunity that will take you out to the wasteland to have you investigate the um, um, the crash ship don't do it <laughs> don't do it if you're trying to keep that thing because you know first of all the opportunity is not that great it doesn't give you a whole lot and second of all um, you lose the opportunity and that's until you have everything you need from it I refuse to lose it so I don't let her go into the science building or the hospital until it's just absolutely something I have to do and I'm ready to give up that um, that opportunity oh, it's up to you though be. if you really want to you can but I don't I don't think so because you don't get that opportunity again unless you have somebody else do it alright yes we're gonna be a bot builder and I don't know if this will actually transfer back to our home world I don't think it does okay you're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna fly you back over since you have the jetpack on um, let's go ahead and fly here and I'm gonna send you inside and you're going to start working on your bot building skills as well. <laughs> it's just too funny to see them crash right there into the concrete. You know it had to hurt. Or maybe it's sand. I don't know. It looks like concrete to me. Um, but I don't know if you can actually crawl through, through, crawl through concrete. All right, let's get over here. And um, now that you're inside, let's go ahead and try designing a trait, a trait chip and then design another nanite. Um, you probably can't do much, but... This is basically how you would do the whole skill. You would just come over here and start working on this bot building machine 
and doing this thing over and over, designing traits, designing nanites. And Luke is going to have to do it as well because he, even though he's got the skill up there, he doesn't know how to make these nanites yet. He's going to have to learn it. So I figure, you know, we'll get them both to kind of work on this, and that'll be fine. All right, not quite ready yet. All right, buddy. Um, is Crash coming? Yeah, Crash is coming. Why don't you go over here and wait on him? Oh, wait, she's right there. Uh, let's go ahead and tune her up real quick. Let's try doing a couple of tune-ups, see what you can get. All right. Oh, we got werewolves. This is our family. Yep, it's our family. <laughs> family of werewolves. Okay, go ahead and do as many tune-ups as you can. I'm hoping that this will work. All right, Meredith, did you finish? No, you got one of them done. Okay. So, what did she learn how to make? I didn't even read it. She learned how to make the competent cleaner trait. And she's also... Alright, she's working on a nanite. So, there's two ways to learn how to do it. You can actually do this. Or you can reverse engineer any of the nanites you've created. So, it's up to you. Um, typically, I'm not going to let them reverse engineer until I have an extra set of them. And I'm going to show you how we're going to get that extra set. Yeah, you guys fight. Okay. How are we doing? Okay, did that build your relationship? A little bit. Did that build your skill? Oh, so now you're up to average. So as you can see, we can actually pull this, um, we can get this Plumbot up in our skill just by tune-ups. So I'm going to let him do that for a little while, and I'm going to let him try to get her up there. The problem with doing it this way is that you have to constantly do these tune-ups to get that average built up. When he creates one um, at a level 10 like he is right now, he'll do a lot better. Stop it. Gosh. <laughs> Just stop it. You're too loud. Um, all right. Go ahead and keep doing nanites. Yeah, you can design all the nanites except for the rare ones. When you get to the point where you've discovered all the nanites here, It'll tell you that there's no more no more that you can design. You have to just go out and find them. And um, we can do that. I mean, we've done it. We've already got them, so we don't have to worry about that. But once she gets level 10, then she'll be able to build any plumbot that she wants with any trait. So, And he's going to have to work on this, too. But like I said, there's something else I want him to work on in just a minute, and he'll get that going. But I want her to get up a little bit higher on the skill. Go ahead and try designing some, some trait chips, too. But I like to just kind of work on these. There's 14 um, nanites you can create with this thing, so she's got to learn it quite a bit. That's why I just keep letting her work on it. And um, then all the trait chips, I can't remember. I haven't counted all those. There's a lot of them, but we do have quite a bit. Okay, age is getting up there. I'm not happy about that. <laughs> we got to work on that. Uh, like I said, I'm probably going to send somebody back. And when we go back to Moonlight Falls, we're probably going to go ahead and... Um, learn the young again potion or we're going to look for that butterfly when in fact why don't we look right now all right you found tunneling fantastic butterfly oh it's right here it is right there okay luke forget this break up the group and i want you where was that thing at <laughs> get over here um luke come on over here real quick and fly fly here and I want you to analyze it a couple of times first actually three times and then you're gonna catch uh, four times because you know just to be on the safe side this is why you get this uh, the science skill <laughs> because uh, when you get these rare things that you might that you definitely need and you know it doesn't come out very often you analyze them so that you can go out and you can create them with the science research station and then you catch it and um, you know, if you don't catch it, that's okay. You at least have a chance of uh, building or making them because you analyzed them enough. So that's pretty good. Now, there's no guarantee that this one will turn into one because, you know, you can always destroy the sample when you're um, trying to clone. But typically, it doesn't happen every single time. So if I get, like, you know, two or three of them, I feel a little bit safer because I know that, you know, if one of them messes up, the other one will still be around. But that's okay. And... I'm hoping he gets. I'm hoping he catches it. If he doesn't, it's okay. We at least have gotten a sample of it, or gotten okay. hopefully a couple of samples. You're fine. Um, what are you doing? You're just looking at him. Okay. Why don't you give yourself a tune-up? Can that? I don't think that actually raises you up at all. I really don't. And let me check your energy. Uh, go over and power up. 
right, let me go back over here and make sure. So this will be great. We wouldn't have to do the whole chemistry station, which, you know, I like the chemistry station, but let me tell you, it takes way too long to get them thing, to get them leveled up to, with all the potions. So I actually prefer to do it this way if you can get all the ingredients, which we can. Now that we got them, I think this is all we were really lacking. So everything else is pretty easy. All right, Meredith, you have to level two. Okay. Okay, we upgraded her to decent. Um... I thought it actually went higher than that. It went to average, didn't it? No, de uh, decent's better than average. Okay, cool. All right, so we'll go back over there in just a minute once he gets this done, and we'll get her upgraded quite a bit, and then we're going to sell her and see how much money we make. Um, all right, what other things do you want to do? Uh, there's no bowling alley here, so you can't do that, and I don't want to do the werewolf thing. We did that for a while. Create a plumb bot. Um, I do want to do that. It's worth 500 and all these are worth a lot more, so I'm not going to mess with that. We're going to do it eventually. We're going to get that a million times. And then you're going to get the ones that say create you know, three plumb bots. And so that's fine. Did you catch it? See, that's the way you do it. Okay, so we're good. Um, let me go ahead and get him back over to the bot station so he can work on good old crash. Let's see. You are here. Fly here. And then, where's my crash? Oh, crash is in the power station. Um, well, crash, how much? You're pretty decent. You don't need to actually do that. Once I get Luke in here. Go over here. Oh, there you go. All right, you get out of here, and you come on over here, too. And uh, let me see if I can get you tuned up a little bit. That noise you hear is the Plumbot Arena next door. It's basically like the Equestrian Center. You don't actually see anything. You just hear it. So I don't really, I mean, I, we did it that one time, um, but it's not really that big of a deal. All right, so she's made another, you can see how many that she's learned how to make because she can now create five of them. And as you can see, each one of them is going to cost us money. Well, that's going to add to the uh, to the cost of, ma of building your Plumbot. So, I don't want to actually spend any money, and I don't want to have to go scour the wasteland all the time. That's why you've got somebody that has the science skill, because Luke, he's going to go in here, and as soon as he's ready, he's going to look at any one of these guys, like these rare ones, and he's going to analyze and make um, cloned copies of all of them. We'll never have to buy a nanite. We'll never have to actually do any of that at all. Um, everything we make will be completely uh, low cost. So we'll make a lot of money off of everything. All right. Uh, Luke, you got everything done. Now, if I can get them working on... I need to get her working on alchemy as far as uh, making a bunch of different elixirs. Because once you get 150 of them created, every time you make one, you end up making three. And you don't use all your materials. So she's going to work on that when we go back home to Moonlight Falls. That'll be her main thing. The first thing they're going to do is they're going to get that Fountain of Youth potion and... Um, they're going to make a couple of those for each of them, so I don't have to worry about them, keep their age down, until we start having kids and all that, which that's going to be a long time from now. I'm not really rushing out to go get kids in this LP. I mainly want to do these guys working together as a couple, get them married and all that, and then work on creating plumb bots, and then eventually we will. All right, she's getting hungry. All right, you know, don't do that. Do this. All right, go ahead and take care of your hunger. And you might as well take care of everything while you're here. I know, I know. You're a witch. You can take care of yourself. Come on. Did I do hunger? Yeah. And then you can go ahead and design more. Alright. I, I did not look at any of these things, so I don't know what we're doing. Um, Alright, so you're still fine. Alright, so we got her up to high tech. High tech is pretty good. High tech is not the highest one, but it's getting there. So... Alright, Luke, you're done. Let's go ahead and tune up again. Alright, go ahead. If we can get her up there as high as possible, then we'll put her on uh, the market to sell, and he will make some money. I don't know how many he's got to go, but we will get this done. The next one, I think... Well, the, the, the top one would be advanced technology, I think. I think that's the highest you can get. And um, I don't think it goes one at a time. I think it jumps like every two little spots or whatever. Oh no, she's next gen. Alright, so it's good. Alright, so if we tried to sell her right now, we would end up making a lot of money. But, if I just go one more, 
get her up to high t uh, to future advanced technology, we will do well. And um, I gave her just the one extra trade. I'm not going to take those traits out since we can actually make them. All right, did you get it? Uh, not quite. Not quite. Keep working. I <laughs> just want to get it done, and then you'll see how much money. Because remember, we didn't spend a whole lot of money on uh, getting this one. We bought it cheap, and then we're going to fix it up, and sell it up, and make make a pretty decent amount of money. At least that's the goal. Um, what is this one? Catch five butterflies. Um, for 275 you know what? I hate that robot form. All right, there we go. Luke, you're done. Cause, so now, if you let me stop him real quick. If you look at it, now she's actually level 10. She's at um, future tech quality, which you can actually see right here. Um, uh, it's the quality. It's the highest quality you can get. At this point, we're going to take her over to this spot, and we're going to see what we can do. If we want to sell a plum bot, let's see how much she'll we'll get for her. Remember, we paid, I believe, nine seventy-four or nine forty-seven or something like that. We paid around that amount for her. So, and he hasn't done anything towards his lifetime wish. So he's got to make um, how much? He got to make seventy-five simoleons just to actually get his next promotion. I think we'll hit that. I really do. I think we'll be just fine. Um, not quite sure how much it'll go, but we'll get some done. Let's see what he actually gets. It should be, it should be over, oh yeah, 3,422, and yeah, we are going to sell her, so say goodbye to Crash, Crash, it's been fun, um, we improved you so that you are going to be, you're going to be actually a very good plum bot for somebody, but I want to keep the ones that I create, I know, that's so sad, bye bye, <laughs> it's so sad to watch that, it really is, but, uh, alright, and did we get a promotion yet? Not yet. It'll show up eventually, I hope. Okay. All right. Looks like we are done, and I am out of time. I'm going to send him downstairs and let him go take care of a couple of things. Let's go ahead and take care of your needs real fast. And then, um, wait a minute. There's not a, um, no, they don't have the other ones in there. Okay. And then what I need to do is have him go get something to eat. Um, it is getting kind of late. But what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to send him over and she's going to go do the same thing. They're going to come back over here to City Hall. And we are going to go and fly over here. Are you done? Yeah, go over here and fly over here. Both you guys are going to do something for me in just a moment. Let's see. Let me make sure. She's probably going to go first because he had to go to the bathroom. At least they can actually fly out of here pretty quick. Now, we are going to be heading back to Moonlight Falls. Um because there's a couple of things I want to do. Um, I really just want to make some money. And one of the ways I'm going to make the money is by going back to Moonlight Falls doing this. We're going to go ahead and check the lotto records. And he should be coming over here too. Come on and fly over here. Alright. He should be coming. I'll wait. See if he crashes. <laughs> he probably will. Um, I don't know where he's at. I know he was downstairs. So it kind of takes him. Well, they locked out or knocked out of their um, opportunities all the time. I don't know. I don't like that, but that happens. So, come on, Luke. Fly. <laughs> fly like you never flown before. Um, yeah, as long as he's outside, it's quick. It's when they're in a building, they have to walk out of it. Then it takes forever. Now, he'll start landing really cool pretty soon once he actually gets that skill up. Um, he's getting there. It's not too much further to level 6. Um, but it's really like a level 8, 9, that area. That's when he starts doing tricks and whatnot when he lands. Um, it's pretty cool. Alright, did you find anything? No. Go do it again. Go do it again. If you didn't find something, it's alright. You just keep looking. You'll find it again. And then when we come back home, we'll play the lottery. And um, Now you can win. Originally, last time I told you that 300000 was the most I'd won. Oh, it can get really, really high. <laughs> you can get a lot of money off of it. So, is that Aiden? Auden. Alright. Okay, so anyway, yeah, you can get well over a million. You can get a ton if you just, it's just all luck of the draw. Um, looks like he's not going to get it either. I don't think he is. All right, go check a lot of records again because you didn't get it. You just got to wait till you get that moodlet that says that you have the insider tip, 
which you know it'll happen it just takes a while sometimes you have to do this two or three times okay she got it so we will be a lottery winner for Meredith in just a little bit All right, Meredith um, you know what I need to have you do something why don't you let's see is it time to go yeah you're kinda he's hungry you're not uh, you're tired though okay play your game <laughs> just play your game <laughs> I don't know if that's actually doing the skill I want you to do, but um, it's fine. You can do what you got to do. Come on, Luke. Just get you trained, get you the, the insider tip, and I'll feel good about it. Yep, you got it. All right, so both of them are ready to go back and win the lottery. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to send them over here uh, before we go home and go to bed because it is only 8 o'clock. And let's come on over here and fly over. And you go ahead and fly over here. And I'm going to have them eat here at the diner. Which I like this diner. I just it took me a while to figure out what to do. Um, now that I got it, it's not too bad. All right, you're gonna go ahead, and I want you to order, um, order hot dog. No, I don't hot dogs. Goopy carbonara. Why not? And then you're gonna order. Um, nope. You need to sit here and order spaghetti. Okay. And so it's basically it's like the. Um, the bistro, the um, business as usual bistro, but without the menus and without the constant thing about the chef. I'm one, I wish you could put this in your home world, but I don't think you can. I don't think it'll work anywhere else except for Oasis Landing, so kind of out of luck. Um, I don't even know if you could put this lot in there. It would make it work. It'd be kind of interesting to try it, though, and see. It would be cool, but unfortunately, at least you can do it here, so you got to look at it that way. But yeah, that that oven from the store, I just get annoyed with that constant pop-up, so it drives me nuts. Now, how come these guys don't fly into the center? Most of my guys, they will fly into this. Yeah, they fly in here. I, they've got it routed that way so that everybody comes in here and they crowd in, and it becomes a big um, tra a little traffic jam there. So I don't really like that, but you got to deal with it. All right. Did you not eat? Oh, you're just eating their food. Okay. Luke. You're fine. You're just sitting there enjoying it. Okay, you quite enjoy it. I'm going to send you guys back home. But you, of course you're going to fly. Um, you might as well. we got other things we got to go do, too. So let me go ahead and have you fly over here. And when you get done, you're going to fly here. We'll get you guys back up and get you to bed. Um, when we actually get up in the morning, I'm kind of thinking we'll head back over to our home, back to Moonlight Falls in the morning. Um just because I want to play the lottery, I want to see if we get enough money, we can buy a house here so we can get out of the base camp. And, um, you know, we actually could probably go ahead and go now, couldn't we? No reason to stick around here for the night. So let's just go ahead and come on back, and I'll send him back over. That way, when we come home, or we get started up in the next episode, we're going to be... Um, I don't know why she's doing that, but she decided to do it this way. Are you here? All right, you go ahead and travel back home. Yes, we want everybody to go with us. So I have no idea where she is. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Did I put anything out? I didn't put anything out in the base camp, did I? I would have done it up here. Nope, I didn't put anything out. So, all right, we're good. I brought all that stuff. Didn't even use it. Didn't need it. Um, but I'm glad I brought it. I just did it on a chain. Ah, somebody fix it. Oh, those plumb bots. Too efficient. <laughs> Don't fix things. I don't want them fixed. I don't want it to stay broken. Yeah, I could just pop it into my inventory. It wouldn't be a big deal. But we're going to get our own home, and we won't have to worry about it anymore. Now, did she want to go home? No, she didn't want to go home. She's like, I want to stay. Yeah, uh, the temptation would be to stick around here and stay here all the time. But, you know, you do need to go back and forth. So, all right, guys, I'm going to go and wrap it up here. When we come back, I'm going to play this game real quick. When we come back, I'm going to... Um, win the lotto and hopefully we'll be able to buy a house both in Moonlight Falls and in Oasis Landings that I want. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time.